Hello guys, Bing here. Um, today we are going to uh, continue have a have a play with with this um, structure、uh, roof structure. So last time,、um, let me just open that file.、Uh, I think it's this one. So last time we、uh, we used、um, mass and divided path and adaptive family to create this, right? So.、Um, Okay, so today、uh, we're going to try something slightly different.、Um, unfortunately, I I'm, I I try to download this file file, but、uh, uh, Rabbit failed to、uh, failed to open this file, so I'm not sure why. I I'm、uh, I'm using 2023, so I don't think it's a, ver a version problem, but、uh, I just can't open it. So. That's fine.、Uh, I'm going to show you. So,、um, try to. So this is not. You can see the the the、um, the height in the middle is、uh, slightly、uh, bigger than here. Then down the this side, this two side.、Um, so I'm going to maybe let me just try to uh, not. Uh, probably、uh, we can't create a roof by. Extrusion because but roof by extrusion is decided、uh, with you、um, decide by the thickness and it can only be one thickness, right? So I'm going to maybe、uh, use model in place instead. So let's just use the roof、um, category、um, extrusion. So use extrusion. So maybe I'll just、uh, I'll use this one. I'll borrow the、uh, uh, need to set our plan first. So I'm going to just use the some face this so this face and then I'll pick this one and maybe I just I just just I'll just draw a、uh, maybe a a arc so something like like this okay so <laughs> and then just close it right so oops something's not right let me just、uh, fix it.、Um, Here and here. So okay. So now we have a.、Uh, I'll just move it to here, and then this. So let's pretend that this is that、um, shape, and also,、uh, of course, we're going to have different. So let me just control C and paste in same place. So we have multiple, and then maybe this one we can just you know、uh, move this up a little. Oh, let's go to here. So move it up a little bit. So from from the other side, so we see we will have pretend this is a roof, another one. So now we we're going to try to、um, try to create something to match that, right? So um, um, we are going to use structure、um, structure framing, okay? So um, but um, because my structure、uh, skill is not very good, so I just、uh, try to. Use um use actually I'm going to use um mass and to help me to place those structure structure members. Okay, so first let me just try uh maybe place I want to place something here. Um,、uh, maybe I'll just drag this back a little bit. So let's pretend we need. A, a truss here and another, another truss there. So what I'm going to do is I'll just go to model in place. I'm going to use mass, okay? Mass and okay. So in mass, so first、uh, I'm going to set our plan and pick this face, and then use reference, pick line, and pick pick.、Um, I think pick this and pick. This. So now we have two. You can see these are two reference lines. So we're going to use same method. Use divided path. I'll just type in a number twenty for for example. So now, so these are the point we're going to place all those um members. Um, but we, oh actually, I'm going to change this one. So uh instead of use reference line, um. Instead of use reference line, so you can use tab. So because we I did I did the divided path. So if you do not use tab, you directly select. You will select this divided path. But the 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 reference lines is behind this. So tab select. 
I'll uncheck that box to make it a model line instead of reference line. So which, uh, so if you finish this mess, you will see that line. Okay, you will see that model line. So let me just hedge hedge this, so you can see this black color model line. Okay, so if 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 they are if they are reference line, you won't see them. You can probably see the nodes, but not the line. So with this model line, so we can directly place family. Ah, oh, so I don't have structure framing loaded, but that's fine. So let's load some. I just go, go to. Uh, so this is Autodesk content a family uh, folder. So you can just go to structure framing. So steel. I go into Australian standard. Um, not sure which one. So if uh, SHS, I think um, maybe let's try this one. Okay, so these are all different size. So maybe I'll just use uh, pick one. Um, <laughs> not sure which one to pick, but yeah, fifty by fifty. Okay, so now so directly use structure beam, and then use if you have this three D snapping pick line. So you can directly place place. The, See, you can place a structure framing onto model line. Okay, so so this is good. And then we need uh, those um, what do we call them web. So uh, either vertical or uh, diagonal. Um, but we can't we can't really place them. So you can place you can roughly from here to to here, but it can be you know oh. <laughs> Go there, uh, so it's yeah, it's a little bit hard to place. So what I'm going to do is, so last time we we we, we modeled the adaptive family to, you know, to create a section of those um, web webs. So so today, so we can still create a family. So uh, still a stru uh, generic model adaptive. Okay, so. Adaptive, so place two points, make a spline, and do not do not check the reference line box because we uh, want to see this model line. Okay, so it should be black. Oh, sorry, I forgot to make adaptive. Okay, so that's it. So let's load this one back in here. So now it can you can place them. Um, let me just hedge hedge. So I just cancel this first. Es escape, h h h h the um, structure framing first, and then go back to component and place this one. So um, depending on how you want to place, so sometimes you you can just use one. Okay, so and you don't need to create of a, a, a section of this. So you can just use one and place some. Know something, draw something like this. So, for example, and oh, hang on, let me just check the the notes because ah, uh, it's oh, sorry, HR. Uh, no, 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 control Z. So it's uh, it's not showing the numbers. Oh, so maybe I'll just um, ah, uh, yeah, I know why, because we are currently outside of the mass. So we need to go inside. Sorry about that. So edit. Now we can select this divided path, and I wanted to show the number. So make sure because last time um, we need to flip the direction. See, so this one's one, two, three. This one's the eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So we need to flip this. So now at least they are the same, right? So then we can start to place. So I'm going to just place something like this. Okay, and then select these, select all of them, repeat. Oh, hell, Control Z. Um, this won't work, so maybe I'll just delete this one. Try again. Uh, still not right. Um, uh, let me let me think. Maybe we we just need to do it s separately. So let's do this one first. Repeat. Oh, good. And then do another one. Uh, maybe this one. Try again. Repeat. Yeah. And uh, do another one. This to here to here. And uh, repeat. Oh, good. So now we have some structure. So um, yeah, depending on uh, 
uh, I'm not sure. I, I need to check. Yeah, looks like about right. So vertical, diagonal. Yeah, all good. And so, so now we have these, right? So now we can finish this mess, right? So now I'm going to type HR to show everything. Uh, maybe H still HH this. And then we can just place um, structure framing using these model lines. So we can just directly place on them. Okay. And yeah, um, yeah, it looks like we have some issue there. Um, I'm not sure how to fix this. <laughs> yeah, because these are, I think we can, uh, I'm not sure. Maybe there's some tool in structure tab and then you can use to, you know, trim them or even here to, um, yeah, I don't know, create some, you know, on the modify and there might be some notch or yeah, some have a try. I, I don't know how to use them <laughs> because um, and my my structure skill is not very good. <laughs> Uh, anyway, so let's just I'll just have another try. Uh, doesn't work. So anyway, so that's it. So this is um, I think you can just use this adaptive family with a model line to help you to place all these. Um, yeah, maybe there's there are some tools um, you can use or plugins you can use to place this very easily. But if you don't have that, um, and if you just want to you know quickly model use structure framing i think this can be um useful uh anyway so that's it so let me just quickly do another one so for example we uh let's um pretend that we need another one here so there so we can just the same i'll just quickly do it model in place mass to get some shape uh, and then set work plan so pick that face uh, use model line pick this line so we have one line and then uh, let's pretend that's another edge so we have these two and then we can use them we can use divided surface or oh, sorry divided divided path and 20 just double check the number so number uh, from one two three this one what's this one same so uh, if it's the same we can directly place uh, this adaptive family so we can just repeat so now we have some uh, and or actually we don't really need those x because um, we can directly so i can finish this mess now and uh, we can just structure beam uh, pick line we can directly pick the place one here one on the top and pick directly place a vertical and you can just create a beam and um, hang on. Uh, let me try again <laughs> structure beam uh, here so you can just use uh, I, I believe you can directly use 3d snapping and try to I'll, I'll always use se to snap the endpoint and here so move onto this beam se and you can directly place so you you can you can do the X use uh, adaptive family, or you can just directly because you already have. Uh, once you place, um, once you place these vertical member, and then you have something, you you, you will have something to to snap onto it. So you can quite easily uh, um, place. Uh, hang on, let me just rotate a little bit. Yeah, sometimes you need to rotate a little bit. So you can pick element. Sometimes it's just uh, won't allow you to pick for some reason. Anyway, so that's uh, that's it. And also, let me HH this once you have, so uh, pretend they are in same, same, at same height. So you want to create some members, you can directly, because you will have all these um, framing in place, you can snap. Uh, 3D snapping, use 3D snapping to pick the endpoint, uh, and then you can just connect to them somehow, <laughs> right? I'm typing SE. Anyway, so that's it. Um, 
And if if you have any questions, please let me know. I will see you next time. Thank you. Bye.